I know what you're thinking. No, this is not a clickbait. Manual trading in MetaTrader used to be hard and frustrating. But in this video, I will show you the best trade manager that makes it effortless and it costs exactly zero dollars. If you watch this video until the end, you will see how to set up advanced trades, including partial take profits, break even, trading stops, and I will tell you the most common mistakes you should avoid. Let's jump right into it. When I first started using MetaTrader, trading was a nightmare. Position sizing was confusing and I could barely set my take profit and stop loss properly. That's why I built this trade manager, to solve those problems once and for all and to make something that anyone can use. Now let me tell you about it. There are two modes in the trade manager, trade and close. First I will show you the fun part, the trade mode. Now before I continue, I just want to ask for your support. I have put a lot of effort into developing this trading manager and I truly believe that it's the best one for free out there. And I promise you, it will stay free. The only thing I ask in return is this. Please leave a short review on the MQL5 marketplace. Not many people do it, but it really helps the project reach more traders. And with your feedback, I can keep improving the product even further. Thank you very much. Now let's go through the trade mode. Here you can set up trades with several advanced options. With this button right here, you can choose the direction you would like to enter. Select long for buy trades or short for sell trades. You can also display all your trades directly on the chart with this toggle. A pro tip, if you can't display the trade on the chart, it's because the stop loss and the take profit are either too big or too small. Next, there is the entry price. You can type in any price you want or simply use ask or bid for a market order. Then comes the volume selection. Here you can choose how to define your trade size by volume, risk or gain. If you select volume, you can enter either the lot amount or the margin the trade would use with the in money or percentage of balance option. In risk mode, you specify how much money you want to risk on the given trade. Again, either a fixed amount or a percentage of your balance. In gain mode, you do the same, but for the amount you would like to earn from the trade. Then there are the stop loss and the take profit parameters. You can set them as price levels, as a percentage of the entry or in points, whichever you prefer. Now, most free trade managers can't even do these basic things I have just showed you. But this one doesn't stop here. Below these settings, you will find automatic tools that makes your trades even smarter. You can add an auto break even simply by setting the distance in points. Once the price reaches that distance, your stop loss automatically moves to your entry level. No need to sit in front of the screen all day. Prefer trailing stops instead? Just turn on the trailing stop toggle and your stop loss will automatically follow the price as it moves in your favor. There's also a risk reward lock button. When it's active, the ratio between the take profit and the stop loss stays fixed. Move on and the other updates automatically. And by the way, trade levels are fully drag enabled so you can adjust them directly on the chart and visualize your setup in real time. Next, let's talk about partial take profits. This feature is only available when the volume mode is selected. You can add up to three partial take profits to your trade. Just specify the distance in points first and then the volume. Be careful though, if the partial volumes add up to more than your total volume or if your partial take profit level is not smaller than the main take profit, you will get an error message. Once it's added successfully, the button will turn green, showing that the partial take profit is now active. You'll also see it appear on the chart with a small drag button so you can fine-tune the level visually. After setting everything up, you can send the order by clicking the big button at the bottom. Green for buy, red for sell. That's it. That's literally how simple it is to enter a trade with full control. Now let's move to the second mode, the close mode. This mode allows you to close all trades or delete orders instantly. Before showing how it works, there is one important input parameter to note. You need to tell the EA whether it should manage only the current symbol or all symbols in your watchlist. Once that's set, the buttons are self-explanatory. You can close open buys, delete sell stops, remove all pending orders, or close trades in profits or loss, or if you need to, close absolutely everything with the big close all button. Just remember, if you have selected current symbol only in the inputs, the EA won't touch other charts. And that's how the trade manager works. You can download it using the link in the description below. It's powerful, intuitive and completely free. Please leave your thoughts and ideas in the comments below and do not hesitate 
to tell me what is missing from this trade manager. If you would like to go even further with managing your trades or you want to create your own ranging or breakout strategies, please make sure to check out the Manhedger EA. And don't forget to test it before purchasing. Now that's it for today's video, I hope you found it helpful. If you want to support my work, please like the video, subscribe and most importantly, leave a review on MQL5. Also, let me know in the comments below what feature you would like to see next. See you in the next one. Peace.